Microsoft Office is an established standard, the golden standard for offices and businesses around the world. As a corporate product, you'll need to pay for a license or, with the advent of Office 365, a monthly subscription to keep using all of its features. While Microsoft does offer some deals that might give it to you for free, there are a bunch of free alternatives that you can use that are just as good, based on what you need to do. Without further ado, here's our top picks. If all you're looking for is a way to edit a few basic documents and collaborate with others, Google's free Office Suite is the obvious alternative. If you already have a Google or Gmail account, it comes bundled in with other Google web apps. Since it works entirely from the cloud, you'll be able to edit your files from almost anything that can run a browser, across most, if not all, platforms. If you aren't already using it, just head to google.com while signed into your Google account and click on the dotted icon next to your profile picture. Scroll down and select from Docs, Sheets, and Slides to substitute Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, respectively. While Google services work fairly well, they can seem a bit light on features from time to time, on top of the need to be constantly connected to the internet to access and edit most of your files. For offline alternatives, we have two free and open source alternatives as our main picks. For a well-supported and feature-rich alternative, we recommend the latest version of LibreOffice. Initially released in 2011, it's been continuously developing and improving since then. Besides your core PowerPoint, Word, and Excel alternatives, the Office Suite also comes with programs for databases, math formulas, and drawings bundled in. Each of its apps have a fairly good list of features that compete with what Microsoft offers, though its relatively long history does mean you might have to relearn or tweak a thing or two that's been done differently in Microsoft Office. For a collection of programs that are a bit more similar in feel to Microsoft Office apps, you can try using only Office. While it does have a few features locked behind a premium version, a similar user interface may help you learn how to use it faster. To try either one out for yourself, just click on the appropriate link in the description below. Both programs work pretty much out of the box, both on Windows and Mac OS. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Microsoft Office and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.